Hey what's going on YouTube, Brandon Wolf here and today I'm going to show you guys how you can play your Xbox on your laptop. So I got my laptop right here, it is an HP NV Windows 10 and I got my Xbox One S right down there displayed on this huge TV in my basement. So the first thing you want to do is open the Xbox app now I'm doing all of this at once if you don't know what to do go ahead and click on the Windows page and if you go to play and explore you just saw it flip right there that is the Xbox app so go ahead and open that it's gonna log you in yeah it may take a while for you to log in didn't take too long so here we have the Xbox app now what you want to do is this bottom one right there, that is the settings. From that one, you want to go one up. You want to go to connection. Go ahead and click on that. It will be connecting. Add a device. It says Xbox One right here. Um, as you guys can see right there. We're going to go ahead and click on that to connect it and it says it is now playing right there it says it's now playing connect to your xbox live and right here it says stream test streaming more so what you want to do from here you guys just see me recording what you want to do from here is press stream and this should work so go ahead and press stream it is connecting to the xbox one it brought this up there are no controllers attached to this PC. Attach one or to your Xbox One and press continue. I guess we'll press continue. Well, my Xbox controller is connected to um, my Xbox, so I don't understand why. But you guys see my Xbox screen. You guys are seeing double, but that's right. So what I'm going to do is going to move the controller down. You see it going down up up down down to the side and it's mimicking exactly on the xbox so let's go ahead and open battlefield one sorry about that noise here we have battlefield one on my laptop as well as on the tv it only works if your xbox is on that's how it can connect if it's not on there's no way of doing this so your xbox has to be on but I'm just going to give you guys a little test, but here is a startup screen that's on the TV, and this is on my laptop. You guys are seeing Battlefield 1 on my laptop. So we're going to go ahead and bring it upstairs and away from the basement. We're going to bring it upstairs and play some Battlefield and let you guys know how it runs. So we are now upstairs, and here we have the Battlefield 1 main menu. Go ahead and take a listen. You can hear the music, it just stopped, but you can hear the music. There we go, just as I was saying, you can hear the music. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the right bumper. It's moving, moving, there's the campaigns. And then if I press the home button, it brings me back to the home. So that is how you can play your Xbox on your laptop. All you have to make sure is you have good connection. It can connect to your Xbox. And of course, you have to have your Xbox on. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And make sure to leave a thumbs up. Share it to those who may need help. Because when I found this out, I was like, oh my goodness. If my TV's in the basement, I don't want to keep going there all the time. I can probably connect it from the basement to my room. I don't know if the connection will be that good, but I could probably play Battlefield or Overwatch on my laptop upstairs in my room if I don't feel like going in the basement. So hope you guys enjoy this video. Leave some feedback and I hope this guys helped you out a lot. Like I said, helped me out a ton when I found this out. Hope you guys are having a great, great day and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.